Okay, our question is, the bar graph shows the number of brick, stucco, and wood houses are on one street. How many houses on the street are made of brick? Use the bar graph to answer the question. So I'm going to go ahead and begin, so you guys may click in. If it's dark blue, you have answered. If it is not dark blue, you have not answered. And it looks like I have six of you in so far. Waiting for two more. All right, everyone looks like they're in. And our percentage. Okay, 75% of you got it correct. And so we've only done one question, so of course, cumulative overall, 75%. Very good, thank you. 75% is what we want to get if we do not have homework. So you may go ahead and begin the question and click in your answer. Okay, on our second question, it looks like we got a 50%. So overall, we have a 62. So it looks like we're going to have to go over another question like this. What I'm going to do is simply just generate another question in the system, and let's go over it again because I'm not happy with 50%. So I'll generate a new question. Okay, now we have the teacher survey students to find out the student's favorite class. Do they prefer math? How many more students prefer math than English? So what we're doing, we're subtracting the two. We're finding the difference between the math bar and the English bar. How many spaces are in between them? So let's try this again. So the first one I didn't help you with, the second one I'll go ahead and help you out with. Okay, for our second question, great, 88%. So overall we now have a 71%. And on that question we did a lot better, so we can move on now that we got an 88%. Very good, guys. You're doing good so far. Okay, let's go ahead and start. And I'll make it a little bigger for you. So you can see the bars for our double bar graph. If you want to see the other ones, I'll go ahead and make it smaller for you. Okay, here. Okay, great. So we have 75% of you that got it correct. Overall, 72. So for tonight, we would have homework since we're not at the 75%. Not satisfied totally with that. So what we would do, we would have homework that would be given to us. So we might have to work more in class here later on because I need to formally assess you a little better. So if I open up my reports after that class, I can exactly go to what class that participated in and get their overall scores of how, how each student did and if I need to do more formative with a particular student, maybe a student who got two out of five with the 40%, I can go back and give them extra work or formatively um, help them do better than the, what they did.